Hi everyone. So, about two months ago, I upgraded my Windows 10 to 11, and I upgraded my Microsoft Office from 2019 to Office 365. After the upgrade, I ran into an issue. I couldn't open Outlook 365. I googled everything I could and tried to solve the problem but none of the solutions worked. I'm gonna show you what I did to fix my issue. Let's get started. Okay, before you do anything, if your Windows 11 has any updates, do the updates first because that might fix the issue. But after the update, if the issues are still there, this is what I did. First, you're gonna go to search or start and type registry editor, press enter. Click on yes. And it'll bring you to this screen. Go scroll down to office. If you're off, if your Outlook 365 couldn't open, you will probably see another folder named 15.0 or, or something else other than the 16.0 and 8.0. So what I did was select 15.0, right click, delete it. And then I select 16.0, right click, and delete it. And after that, I just close this window and I go back to apps, sorry, settings and apps. Apps and features. And you're gonna scroll down to Microsoft 360 and you're gonna click on the three dots and then click on modify and then click on yes yes this window will pop up and you are going to click on online repair and click on repair. What it does is it will reinstall Microsoft 365 and it will repair that folder. I think the reason why we couldn't open Outlook All 365 after the upgrade was because the previous version was well, somehow there was a folder there created by the previous ver version of uh, Outlook. So I guess that confused the Outlook 365. So after I did the repair, I was able to open my Outlook. And thank you very much for watching. I hope this helps you. Bye.